Hey, what's going on you guys? Today's video is sponsored by LazFit, who specialize in automotive lighting. We got some high power LED chip lights that we're gonna be installing instead of these amber ones that come in the car. Let's get right into it. All right, here we go. We're gonna unbox the LED lights now. All right, so we do have a last fit product manual and they show you all the steps to do it. Even though it's a really simple and easy installation, I'm glad they still included a manual for everybody. And then we got some awesome last fit LED lighting decals. We got white, black, and red. Nice little variety right there. And then we also do have the lights, of course, and these look awesome. They got a little fan on the end to keep them cool, and uh, that's about it. All right, so we did take one out off of video, so we would do it correctly. So now to show you guys, basically what you're gonna wanna do is it's gonna be this bulb right there, right in the center. Um, you can't really mistaken it for the high beam. And then just get like a flat head or that little tool they gave you and push the clip up. So here we go, I show you guys, you just push that clip, get right behind it and push it up and then just push down and the clip's gonna come off. So there we go, now that the clip is off, you can actually take out the old light. So just twist it counterclockwise and it should pop right out. It was pretty tight, so just put a little bit of pressure into it. Don't be worried about breaking it since they are really tough. And there we go. So the old light out, now let's put in the new last fit ones. This is the size difference, look at that. The new ones look way cooler and it's got this whole little power part for the fan. All right, so now you're just gonna plug in the last fit ones really easy and plug it right in. You may have to switch it around and unplug it and plug it back in again because there's only one side that works. So we had to do that for one of the lights when we tested it. So just go ahead and do it on the second side as well and plug it in. And then to put the light in, it's very simple. Just line up the three little grooves. And you'll just line up those grooves and then twist it in. So you can't really see here because it's such a tight space, but you just have to line up the three grooves on the light. Once they're lined up, you just twist clockwise this time and it will tighten it. All right, so here we go. We're gonna test them out and see if the LEDs work. If they don't work right away, you may just need to switch the uh, plug the other direction. All right, and there we go. Look at those LED lights. Looks way better on my car than those halogens. I'm really happy with how these turned out. And they just look way brighter than the other lights. So a lot safer for night driving. Oh my goodness, that looks great. So here's a little comparison of what the amber looks like on my car before we switched it versus the new last fit LED ones. And just look at that difference it does to the front end. And then here we go, we got the passenger side amber and then switching to the last fit LED just changes the whole look of the front end and makes it so much safer for driving. All right, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you so much to Last Fit for sending these out for a review. And if you guys did enjoy the video and are interested in purchasing some of these, I will leave a link in the description down below for you guys to go check out these Last Fit lights. Leave a like if you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace out, everybody. Oh my gosh, what's this? I just found some LED lighting in the hood Don't of my Don't do car. that one. <laughs> <laughs>